let's set out the graphical screen of our app. Over in the app section under layout, activity main, go ahead, open that, and you can rearrange things to make a little room. And in here we have this hello world text label. We're going to move that around a bit. So over on the right hand side in properties, you can change the width of it, click this down, and let's say fill parent, and that will make it the full width of the screen. Then we can change the height, and we're going to set a specific height, let's say 100 dp. Now you may be used to seeing px for pixels after 100, but you have to bear in mind that every Android device has a different pixels per inch value. So dp is Android's way of normalizing that across all devices. So 100 dp will be just be decimal points. Okay, once we've done that, we need to pop in a button onto this screen. So over on the left in our palette, let's scroll down and let's find button. There it is, button. Let's drag it over and drop it in there. And before I let go, you'll notice at the top it says center horizontal below equals generated. And this is Android Studio's really helpful layout guide. And it says, I'm going to center this in the horizontal part of your screen. And I'm going to put it below whatever's just above it or whatever we've kind of snapped to. So if we go here, you'll notice it goes away. But if we go here, the orange box snaps to the hello world. And if you let go there, that button will now always appear underneath that main box. Now when you click button, you can change the properties over on the right, like name and things like that, and its ID. But we can also do it in the XML. So down at the bottom where it says design and text, hit text, and this is the entire XML that goes behind that layout you just saw. So we have our text view, which is hello world at the moment. We're going to change the ID of that here. Actually, we're going to leave that as it is. We can leave it as text view. For button, we're going to change the text of it. So Android text is equal to, and we are going to say change dot dot dot. So when I click the design section, we can see it there as change and we can zoom in if we like. Okay, click the hello world text and over on the right, we're just going to align that to the center. So we want the text to sit directly in the center. Come over to your properties panel, scroll down and we want this section called gravity. And we can say gravity and we can have center vertical and center horizontal but I'm not going to click that. I'm going to click text and show you that you can do it in here. In the text view XML, just after the ID, I want you to start typing gravity and you'll notice it gives you the options. And when you press enter on the option, it again gives you the options. So you have two ways of working with this. So I'm going to say center horizontal. If we switch back to design, you'll notice hello world pop straight back into the middle. And under gravity, if we also select center vertical, it goes to the center. And if I go to text, you'll notice it puts this pipe symbol between the two. So you can have two values inside of gravity. Okay, that is all we need for this screen. And that concludes the laying out of the XML of our app. So just for future reference, all of your layouts sit underneath this res and layout folder.